If you're like me, at some point, quite a while ago, I changed the settings on my iPhone to do not allow the ability to delete an app. So in this example, I want to get rid of the top left app I downloaded. It, it sucks, so I want to get rid of it. But when I go to click to remove it, instead of saying this, it only gives me this window. And I'm like, why can't I delete it? I don't want to just remove it. I want it off my phone completely. Well, it's been so long since I did it, I couldn't remember. So I'm making this video for me just as much as for you. And the, the setting is buried pretty deep in settings. So here you go. You go to settings. Scroll down, look for screen time, select screen time, go down to content privacy restrictions. From there, pick iTunes and App Store purchases, select deleting apps. Change it back to allow. Go back out, make sure it still shows allow. And now you're going to go back and find the app you want to delete. Do a long press, get the window to come up, and select Remove App. Now we got the Delete App option. You click on that. It's going to prompt you, are you sure? You know, it's going to remove all the other data, and you're like, OK. And now the app is gone off your phone completely. Now if you're like me and you're concerned about accidentally deleting your apps, go ahead and go back to the settings. Screen time, content, privacy restrictions, iTunes and App Store purchases, select deleting apps, and switch it back on to do not allow the ability to delete an app so it doesn't happen on accident. Apple sure buried this deep in iOS 14. As always, thank you for watching, and please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.